Okay, hi, it's Jess again. Um, this is a really quick blog about all my Harry Potter stuff. So, let's get started. Okay, here we go. Just, just dropping the camera. Okay. Okay, so this is my box set Harry Potter. One, two, three, four. There we go. They're all in, um, they're all still in their case. I haven't actually read those ones because I keep them safe. This is number five. I love that book. Okay, half back. Number six, half a prince. That's half back. La la, number seven. That's my favourite. I like that one. Another copy of Prisoner of Asquam. Don't know why I have that. Um, oh, this is what happens when we take books on holiday. Look. Look, the glue melts and, and they get destroyed. The glue melted and... Now, yeah, it comes apart, so I'm missing a few pages, which is why I have the other copy of the fourth. Okie dokie, there we go, let's put that away. Um, this one's called Quidded Through the Ages. Um, J.K. Rowling wrote that for charity, I think. Um, this one is Fantastic Beasts and Where to Find Them. They're supposed to be like books that they used as their school books in the Harry Potter. I haven't read them all the way through. Magical Wards of Harry Potter, not actually written by J.K. Rowling, but it's about myth within the book, like the use of myth and how she does stuff. I haven't read that all the way through, but it's quite good. Um, what's next? This is my fantastic little Hogwarts binder. Yeah, it's got all the stuff on the front. And, uh, and there we go. Gryffindor, Slytherin, Hufflepuff, um, Ravenclaw. It's got all of those. Mm, what's next? What should we have next? Oh, look, it's Harry Potter First Happy Families, Philosopher's Stone. This is Harry Potter Prisoner of Azkaban, Happy Families, so they're like a little card game. Okay, next, next, next. This is Hedwig. She's my little model Hedwig. Oh, look, she's so pretty. She sits on my side. I like her. Um, oh, and this is my quill. I got that when I went up to London. That was quite expensive for a purple feather. Um, this is gonna be all my games, there we go. Game Boy, Harry Potter 1, it's for Game Boy Color, that's old. PlayStation 2, Harry Potter and Goblet of Fire, I beat that like a few months ago. Um, PlayStation 1, Harry Potter and Philosopher's Stone, that's old, I beat that. Oh, PlayStation 2, Harry Potter and the Order of the Phoenix. This is so good, I love that game, I recommend it. Harry Potter, um, Dan Radcliffe actually, in My Boy Jack, he's so hot in that. And I have newspaper clippings of Roop and M as well, but not really sure where they are right now. i sort of gone walkies, I think they're in my media project. Um, okay, there we go. Next is my, Oh, this is my night shirt now, but it's my little Harry Potter t-shirt. I got back when Philosopher's Stone first came out, um, this first one. And I got that from ooh, from Legoland, which is this little place. Um, oh, look, Harry Potter toys. These are so cute. These are like, um, not quite Lego, but um, little Harry Potter models. I have some Harry Potter Lego too. Oh, who have we got? Oh, there's Ronikins. And... Ooh, no, it's Hagrid. Come on, Hermione. There's Hermione. She's so cute. Yep, so they're my little Harry Potter Lego-y type toy type things. Um, this is my fan art that I filled this little book up with. I'm not very good at drawing, so I'm, I'm not going to show you very many, but here is Harry and Ginny, Ron and Hermione, Harry and Ginny, Harry and Ginny, Harry and Ginny. I have a bit of obsession with drawing a Harry and Ginny fan art. La la. There we go. There they are again. It's Harry and Ginny. Oh, it's Ron and Hermione. Harry and Ginny, Ron and Hermione. Ooh, look, there's Draco and Hermione. It's my only Draco and Hermione one. Oh, there's Harry and Ginny and Ron and Hermione in the snow. There's them at the beach or whatever. Um, there's the four of them. It's Harry and Ginny again. Um, ooh. That's that book, I think. Oh, there we go. That's that book. Um, what's next? 
Oh, book number two. There's some really bad drawings in here. Here we go. Harry and Ginny, my first ever Harry Ginny fan art thing. And my first ever Ron and Hermione one. Ooh. That's not so great. Um, that's that book done then. Okay, um, oh look, here's another book. I did covers for all the videos I did, or for some of the videos that I made on YouTube. I started drawing covers for them, but couldn't be bothered. Here we go, here's the four when they're like leaving Hogwarts. It's quite a bad drawing actually. Um, here is R, Harry and Ginny, and Ron and Marnie. Okay, oh, there's Harry and Ginny's first kiss. I love that drawing, I really want to get it made bigger. There's Ron and Hermione when they're growing up with baby babies. They call us the babies. Um, there's Harry, baby, 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 Ginny. Aww, when they're all grown up. Cute. And oh, me and my friends used to do this thing where well, we would pretend we were in Harry Potter. I'm sure everyone's done it. And I actually wrote this is like pages and pages of work I did on all sorts of things like runes, uh, dream diaries, herbology, Oh, look how much work I did, it's crazy. And we like made up names and we did make ones but I am, um, I don't know what I did with them, I think I sat on them and broke them a while ago. Um, look, there's some more runes. We like got really into it, played it every weekend, made up these little characters, that little ongoing storylines yeah this is like folder full of flipping work i did and there's all the notes we sent each other in character um so it's folder number two this is when we had a break and we did it for a second time wow there's a whole a whole essay i wrote on nicholas flamel oh my gosh there's um my timetable i made up uh, some divination work there's some um, Oh, we spent hours on this. Herbology. Yeah, that's Devil's Snare. Um, that's all sorts of things. There's an owl's wing. There's um, Phoenix Unicorn. La la. We used to like, make potions over my sink as well with all this like cheapy bubble bath we'd got. <laughs> that was good fun, actually. Um, we used to mark each other's work. And we used to pretend to be different characters for each other, there's my love potion, there's like little notes we wrote to each other, it's my cool Harry Potter note paper, I love that, and that's that folder basically, and then we have, this is a notice board I like made up, we wrote notice boards and stuck them on my wall, signed it and everything, this is my fan fiction um, folder, this is where all the stuff I wrote my Harry Potter fan fiction in goes to. There's like, I plan everything, I plan what I'm going to do during the years, yeah, I like, I do all sorts of stuff like timetables, that's their individual timetables, make calendars, um, all sorts of things. That's an exam timetable I made so I could work out when they had their individual exams in the characters in my book. There's, on my Harry Potter paper, that was from Philosopher's Stone when that was first out. So cute, it looks like parchment and you can write on it in red ink and it looks like you're writing a riddle's diary in blood okay um <laughs> we need to hurry up and hurry up this is like already bad because i don't have an actual webcam i'm having to film this and then record over it with my voice with the microphone it's daniel radcliffe he's so gorgeous that's my goblet of fire poster it's the only poster i have up at the moment um i've got an order of the phoenix one but i've got no space for it so my wonderful poster of him who I love very much and oh there we go there's my Harry Potter pencil case and you had forgotten something Hermione Harry and Hagrid that's basically it now guys um I'm gonna have to go really quick sorry this hasn't been very good but I don't have a real webcam um not very much Harry Potter stuff I realize but it wasn't meant to be like a competition or anything and um I'm quite proud of some of it because it's all my own so yeah, just leave your comments and thank you for watching. Bye!